Hello, Virginia Martin. Hope everyone is well. Just sharing a, a journal I made, um, trying to keep practicing my new uh, craft interest of junk journaling. And I, this is a five by seven uh, journal. Uh, has uh, laced here on the spine. As you can see, the cover itself is wallpaper which I thought would make a nice cover. Uh, this tassel I added from another journal I had. And I just added on a ball pin, uh, this safety pin with the little beads there, this rose, and this other little charm for interest. On the cover, I put this. I added this little fabric piece and added a little button. It turns out to uh, be botanical slash green most of the color in there is green which is funny because that's not one of my favorite colors it kind of just developed that way if i didn't mention it it's five by seven ten full pages making 40 writing services front and back so let's take a quick look inside inside covers i, I put this pocket there from a, a magazine image i added this trim and I added this Tim Holtz, life doesn't have to be perfect to be wonderful. And then I just added a couple pieces on the pocket for interest. And this is trimmed with green trimming. I had gotten this page from an ephemera packet I purchased. And then a succulent um, sticker I added there for added interest on the other side of that, I continue with the green trim, Tim Holtz image. I just kind of added a bit of flowers there, a mini collage. The other page, I added the stamp that says, I love this life. Added a couple of stickers there. I added this other little stamp. And then I added this little tuck spot here has a little envelope with a couple of pieces of ephemera inside. And this is an old uh, postcard image. I'm not sure the postcards, I don't see the backing of it. I think I just got this as ephemera and they uh, backed it up with regular paper for writing. I try to keep a lot of writing surfaces clear of any major embellishments. So you'd have plenty of room to, somebody would have plenty of room to journal. And I'm trying to make my journals now with with thought in mind of someone who gets it, how I would like to get it, how they would like to receive it if I were to ever sell my journals. So they're really more on the simple, but I feel uh, the embellishments I add are good enough uh, to make it interesting. On this page, I added the washi on the top. It's, uh, I want to say, I don't know if it's rice paper, but it was from a journal I had and it's nice and thick. And I had this little tab here with the stamped high on it. On the on the side of that, a Tim Holtz image with a little tag, and I feel so lucky. This is um, another page uh, that I had gotten from Performer Ephemera. I stamped Life is Good, and that's another little stamp there ledger paper i love ledger paper <laughs> so i just added this sticker there i added the stamp and then here i just attached uh a nice uh, bo uh my bobby pin it's not a bobby pin <laughs> paper clip with a little lace on there and this flips out this little bird like that so you could write there and this is just an added piece of paper to write on No paper overall. I just put this to add a little bit of interest to the page. This is just uh, from the stamping on the other side. And this was on the other side of the paper clip I just pulled, but I had put this little guy there. You can write on the back. And another, I think these are like life cards, life project cards, I think. So that it just went together because of the colors, the green. And this is golf paper that I purchased, I think at the thrift store, it was a whole pack of it. So I thought it'd be good with this journal. 
and this is the pocket right here I added the washi to make it look like mountains and this is a cup of Tim Holtz um, those mini little uh, paper dolls I added happiness to it and then I added uh, this and this because it went this one says love if you can read that sorry I thought that was nice to put on that and the paper is um, I'm not sure what you call this paper when children learn to write cursive <laughs> that type of paper <laughs> uh, this is the other pocket and then I added this little collage element here with some stickers some fabric a little bit of lace I added this here I added um, this is from ephemera I got from before it's just a page that's like a index card and some other writing paper and inside I made a little pocket on there as well and just added these two little things here this is a uh, right in the back I added that little flower there and this little coca-cola mini playing card I think I had shared that before in another video on this page um, I just added a belly band with these two uh, pieces of papers like book paper book looking images I added the uh, butterfly and I just added a couple of, this is an uh, index card I had embellished with napkin writing and then this is just um, a card I had another plain card but I liked it matched again the color of the green here I made a tuck on the top and added a uh, some unsuring card if I made the ephemera I will let you know if not all the ephemera I'm showing you is from different sources and I, I honestly cannot remember all the sources I've purchased ephemera from, so I apologize for that. But I will let you know if I've done ephemera. Um, this is from a book I got at the Dollar Tree um, called Hope. So I just took pages from it. This is just one page to um, add to this journal. And this is a page I had from a uh, notebook. That I had purchased a while ago but I like the little flowery image there I just added a couple a sticker there on the other side another sticker I left it mostly blank so you have a lot of journaling space there this is an over the um, page writing spot if you will Let's see if I could take the paper clip out it's hard to use a camera and try to <laughs> film at the same time but um i had done this as a time card that i had embellished um with napkin so this is the full card i just decided to just use it as an over the the page embellishment i added a little these stickers here and then these little these are stickers too but just to add interest to the page sticker this is the other side the sticker the other part of that uh, page from the Hope uh, book. And here I added these stickers to just um, add a little bit of interest to this page. Here I put a little, I guess, tuck spot uh, along the length of the page and added this um, card right on the back. And this is another card I added. Let me just tuck here. I made a little tabby so you could just do that on the page this is washi on the side I added this inspiration I try to put inspiration and positive messages throughout my journals I put that on the top uh, here it's another and these are all from Tim Holtz these phrases this is the other golf page and here on uh, this I had embellished um, this index card I had just gotten the index card by itself so I embellished it with this little bird with this Tim Holtz phrase and added a couple little flowery things here in the sticker turn it around and here another sticker another Tim Holtz phrase with, I added the lace and then in it I made it into like a pocket I attached this 
to the index card and in this pocket it's a little pocket and you have a couple pieces there to work with and then it has the uh, paper clip with the ribbon which i love for that this is a little tuck spot mini uh, belly band so sunshine i added these flowers and then just a few pieces here um, to add to the journal if need be this is the flip out so this is the piece of paper the flowers it was like uh, writing paper and then here i just added the little lace so it could it look i thought it looked nice on the page the lace you flip it out so you have all the surface as well to write on and i added these little stickers there and this is ledger paper so i added that this is washi tape a little um stampy embellishment there flowers and this is again part of the other side of that um i think is rice paper i'm not sure don't quote me a tim holtz image this is rickrack that i just put through the little holes that the page had and then added that phrase and the other side this is the rickrack again i just um glued it there on the page put this little circle there with another tim holtz phrase and this is a wash um, this was washing from the other page sorry on this page i added the little guitar another phrase there washing um i had this uh, die cut image and i just added this little ribbon here this was part of what was a ribbon in the front with a little sticker for interest and i just added a couple little things you can um this you can actually write on the back and this I got from another piece of ephemera. Again, the colors match nicely and I just added these stickers to make the page interesting. And this is the back of the, of the signature. I added this yellow flower with the little dot there, another little die cut there, and this is the other ribbon to complete the look. And this is the back um, cover. I forgot to mention that the wallpaper didn't have backing to it so i backed it with this and this is a kind of um nice textured i believe it was like a tissue type paper but i i i had glued it to the back of the wallpaper forgot to mention that this is a clear plastic uh, pocket there um so i put this paint chip with my um journal when i do journals i like to um, put this on there faith by design creations is what i've come up with as i make journals going forward and i did a little paint a little piece of paper there you can write in the back and then this tag i actually did um make i rubbed on this unicorn image added a little lace and a little tab there and then on the back of that is i added uh, more lace you can definitely write on the back for sure and that is the back of the journal and um, I just hope you enjoyed it uh, thank you again for all your support bye bye